Hey everybody, this is Juan from the Two Brothers Real Estate Team and today we're going to be talking about the top three elementary schools in Langley, okay? So again, if you are thinking about moving to Langley and you're not sure where to move because of course you want the best schools for your kids, this is the video, all right? So let's get started. Okay, before we go right into the video, make sure that you press the subscribe button, press the bell because we're actually putting brand new videos every single week that's going to help you either buy or sell your home, all right? Okay, so let's get started with number three school in Langley, okay? And that school is the Langley Fine Arts, okay? Now, the principal is Mr. Adam Moore okay and the school is actually rated seven out of ten now it might look a little low but this rating is comparing langley fine arts with all the schools in bc okay so again is the number three in langley and is rated seven out of ten compared to all the schools in bc okay now it's located in fort langley the address is 1996 Travel Street, okay? And you can see the map there, Fort Langley. It's a little town, a little neighborhood north of the number one highway. The number one highway, of course, is the highway that goes all the way east to west, all the way to Vancouver, okay? So it's located just north of the number one highway. Now, they have they start at kindergarten, okay? So if you have kindergarten kids, you can start to, uh, you can move to the school and it goes all the way to grade 12, which I think is actually quite convenient because once you have your kid, uh, you know, in kindergarten, you can be there, you can be located in, Lang in Fort Langley for, again, until they graduate, okay? So you don't have to kind of move to another school or so on, okay? So this is kind of one of the convenience of the Langley Fine Arts. Now the school hours are from 8.45 to 2.16 or 2.31, depending what grade is your kid in. And this school is perfect for you if you're looking for a school that it actually focuses on the arts. Of course, it's called the Langley Fine Arts. So there's a lot of arts, dance, drama, music, and so on. By the way, my daughter uh, goes to this school and she loves it. And of course, I love it myself, all right? Now, let's go on to top two, the second top school in the Langley area, and that's Willoughby Elementary, okay? Now, the principal is Mrs. P. Giovanni. I couldn't find a better picture of her, uh, but there it is, okay? Now, the rating is actually 7.3 out of 10, okay? Remember that this is based on all the schools in British Columbia. Now, it's located in Willoughby. Willoughby is just the neighborhood south of the number one highway. So as you can see right there, there's the number one highway. And it's just, again, on 80th and, you know, 207, okay? So it's right there. Um, by the way, I'm going to be giving you the, the PDF for all the catchment for, for the schools, okay? So even though it's a small picture right here, I'm gonna give you the whole, a PDF so you can actually see what neighborhoods and so on are, um, you know, where you should be moving if you want your kid to go to this school, okay? Now, there's over 525 students and it goes from kindergarten all the way to grade five. So again, just be aware that once your kid hits grade five, you're gonna have to look for another school. Now, school hours are from 845 to about 216 to 231, depending again, the grade of your kid. And yeah, I think that's about it for that, okay? Now let's move on to the number one school in Langley, elementary school in Langley, and that's Alex Hope Elementary School, okay? Now the principal is Mr. N. Herkel. Herkel, I couldn't find a picture, okay? So again, sorry about that, I couldn't find the picture. Uh, but the rating is 7.5 out of 10, okay? Again, this is based on all the schools in BC. Now, it is located in Walnut Grove, okay? So again, Walnut Grove is a neighborhood that's actually north 
of the number one highway. So again, as you can see, there's the number one highway. So it's just north of the number one highway to 1150 85th Avenue. There's over 560 students and it goes from kindergarten all the way to grade seven, as you can see right there, my face was covering it. Um, the cool thing about this school is that they have a French immersion program. So if you're thinking about that, this is definitely a school that you want to look into a little bit deeper, okay? And the school hours are from 8.31 to 2.17 in the afternoon, okay? Now, let's talk about the overall rating of the schools. And again, this is based on zero to 10, okay? And we just talked about it. Alex Hope, which is the best school in Langley, has an overall rating of 7.5, Willoughby 7.3, and Langley Fine Arts is at seven, okay? The average school, the, the, the rating for, the average school average for all the schools in BC is six, okay? So as you can see, it's definitely above average for all three schools, okay? Now, the grade four average score for reading, okay? So this is something that's important to you, the reading part of things. Again, this is how they rate. Uh, the average reading score for all schools is 486.4, Alex Hope is 489, Willoughby for 506, and the Langley Fine Arts is at 489. And of, of course, if you read it here, the indicator shows how well each school students perform compared to students in all other schools on the Uniform Foundation Skill Assessment in Reading, Writing, and Numeracy in grade four, okay? I know that there is another assessment in grade seven. This is only for grade four. Now, in regards to writing, the average grade is 584 for all the schools. And as you can see, Alex Hope is above average at 608. Willoughby is actually under the average score at 563 and the Langley Fine Arts are going at 616, which is of course above average. Now we move to the numeric side of things, right? The numeracy side of things, the average score for all schools is 481.6. All three schools are above average. Alex Hope at 510, Willoughby at 521, and the Langley Fine Arts at 584. Okay, so as you can see, that's that gives you hopefully that gives you a little bit better idea of where these schools are sitting compared to other schools. Okay, uh, gives you a little bit of more clarity of what's happening here. Now, like I mentioned before, I'm going to be attaching a link so you can actually download the PDF in which Again, you can actually see all the school catchment areas in the Langley area, okay? So you have a better idea of where to move or what neighborhoods are best for you if you wanted to, if you're actually just moving because of a school, okay? Um, now, if you're moving to Langley, you're thinking about moving to Langley, make sure that you actually give us, uh, contact us, okay? You can contact us through going uh, you know, by going to our website at twobrosrealty.com. You can also email us at the brothers at twobrosrealty.com or you can actually call my office at 604-530-0231. Okay, so again, hopefully this helped you. If you have any questions, concern, get a hold of us. Uh, but besides that, make sure that you subscribe to our channel and I will talk to you later.